Oh no, come on in. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm always busy, but come on in. Um, this is the shipping invoice? Okay. Well, yeah, um, can, can we have a, let me have a word with him and then, uh, Okay. Well, I've got the invoice. Let me go over everything, and I'll I'll get back to you, and I'll tell you tell you how to proceed. Um, the packing list is right here. Let's see if I got my pen. Sit down. It's okay. No. It's a Monday. There's never a good time on a Monday. And um, I got this package from the uh, company that is, uh, it's not a big package. They're going to take over uh, supplying our canteen. And I have to review the uh, items to make sure they're all kosher. And I um, just figured I'd have a chance to sample them and have a snack on my break. You can see they, they sent them to me right here. Uh, yeah. Codename TR de Guelo. <laughs> That's pretty cool. And it's, well, let's just sit down and we'll talk about your problem while I check all this off and we get it done. How's that sound? All right. Just a minute. Is, if this is serious, I, I can make time for you. Okay. Yes. Mariel. Yes, I'm going to be um, visiting with someone during my break. It's, a, it's an important meeting. Uh, I'll need some privacy for the next um, half hour, hour. When you see him come out, you'll know I'm available for calls. All right. I'm taking care of the canteen. I'm taking care of the package. I understand. <sighs> Mariel, please. <sighs> we'll call my sister Joanne. She can get a hold of Marvin, and we can find out if Alexander's fine. How's that sound? Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Bye. Okay. I need... Okay. Bye. I'm sorry. My um, nephew is on campus right now. And uh, near, near here, there was an emergency lockdown of the campus. And um, no, I'm not, I'm not making it up. I, I I got a hold of my wife, and she got a hold of my sister-in-law. We believe he's okay. He messaged us real quickly that he's all right, but it was in or around the engineering department, and that's where he actually attends. So you could say that my family's a little confused right now on the whereabouts of my nephew. So I'm going to get right into this, and... Uh, you can help me check stuff off, and uh, they put a brown paper on it, which I thought was nice. Okay, this company is called treats and you can you can share with me I wasn't uh, I know Mariel's waiting for the leftovers but I was uh, I wasn't planning on having company I just wanted to get through this real quick but this company treats they supply snacks and items from all over the, the world so what interested me is because we have international travelers and we're always constantly spying and trying to find out what's going on in other countries. I thought this company might add a level of intelligence to our services because we can use the snacks from different areas of the world to educate our 
field agents on what particular snacks, say in Israel or Russia, Germany, would be acceptable, you know, and uh, nutritional and worth their pursuing. In, in a hurry, in a rush, it helps to have education on what's available in the local jurisdiction that you're in. It's a very nice little box. I love how they print the boxes for these companies. <clears throat> okay, let's take a quick peek. Let's see what they sent us. Oh, this uh, was something I specifically wanted. They sent us treats from Serbia and Croatia, that area, the former Yugoslavia. Located in southeastern Europe, Croatia is adjacent to the Adriatic Sea and is neighbored by Serbia. Serbia and Croatia share a common history, for they used to be the same country under the name Yugoslavia before Croatia split into its own country in 1991. As such, Serbia and Croatia share cultural similarities, and one of those is they eat the same snacks, and you will find many of them in your box this month. As you dig in, you will find snacks like Grisky Peanut Pretzels, a representation of the region's love for pretzels and peanut flavored snacks. You will also find unique sweets you may have never tasted before, like the Euro Creme Bloch La Smooth Chocolate Bar, made from a blend of hazelnut cream and chocolate. Is that something you get out of the vending machine? Benanko, a banana flavored chocolate bar, and one of the most popular treats in the region, and more. Hope you enjoy. Alright, so they sent me a nice little card. Wasn't that nice? Mm hmm. Little card, and there's all the information I read. Croatia's a nice part of the world. I, I, I like it. I, I spent a little time near there in Greece back during the war. That's very nice. And then this is the part of the world they're in. You know, it's near Greece. It's in the Balkan area. They call that the Balkan states. Okay, well, let's just, um, I have it wrapped in tissue and everything. Look at this. This company wants our business. And like I said, you know, what do you know about Croatia and Yugoslavia as a field agent? Do you know anything? You don't. Well, if you get stuck there, this would really help you, you know, as a spy, to be able to handle the local, you know, treats and foods that are available and know what's junk, what's junk food, what's healthy, what's, you know, good for you. So, they even sent us a nice box uh, with, uh, or box, they sent us a nice card here to help us. Oh, isn't that nice? And look at this. What a surprise. Look at that. I don't think I could even sample all of this. So It's just too much. You're going to have to help me. Definitely. Oh, wow. Um, this looks like coconut. I'll have to look. Yes, it's a kitty coconut dessert. Look at that. And this is a Euro creme block of chocolate. Look at that. Wow, that is a heavy bar of chocolate. And we have this Dorina milk. It's just some kind of milk chocolate here. And Grisky. Grisky. These are like salty, pastry-filled crackers. They look really good. Hmm. Bonanco. Oh, I just know everybody wants to see me cram a big old banana in my mouth. <laughs> it's very popular these days. I don't know what's gotten into the kids, but uh, maybe we'll have a taste of that. Looks good. I'm not huge on coconut in candy. Um, these look really good. These are probably my, might be my favorite cookie. 
because they're hard to get good ones, and that is a marshmallow cookie. It's chocolate on the outside, and uh, I'm going to look at these right now. Marshmallows, Munchmallow by Jaffa. Okay, now look at this. Isn't that just adorable? You picked a good day to come in and talk to me. Look at that. Oh, wow. Little foil wrapper. It's falling apart here. It didn't travel that well. Nice little foil wrappers. It's all crushed on top, but that's just from travel. Mm. Oh. Now that. Hmm. That is a classic. Quality. Cookie with marshmallow and chocolate on it. Well, not chocolate, the chocolate fudge. Mmm. No. <clears throat> this is what I'm talking about. You're in Croatia and you're getting sick. And you need something to get you going. You need a little sugar, you need a little fruit juice, and you need some vitamin C. The vitamin C to help you fend off fend off a cold, say, when you don't have a lot of medical help. So these little treats, these Kiki Plus, are fruit flavored, square shaped toffee candies that are soft and chewy in texture, similar to a Starburst. A Kiki Plus have a plus in their name because they are enriched with vitamin C. So, you know, we're going to go right into this because I want these in my, uh, I want these in my vending machine where I work because uh, just like a little, A little vitamin C addition to your diet is always a good idea. And they're just a chewy little starburst. Mm -hmm. So, I'm doing all the talking. What brings you here today? You're having anxiety? Mm-hmm. Feeling anxious. Okay. Well, it's always good to discuss these things. I'm listening. Mm. It's really chewy. I don't really like it. A little burst of vitamin C. That's what we need. You know? The positive. Mm. Oh, did you want one of these? They're so good. Here, you can have a couple. I almost feel selfish. I should ask um, my secretary to come in. Now this... How can you be anxious when there's a little tiny green and yellow monkey on a banana wrapper? Honestly, how can you be depressed and anxious? Am I correct? Well, eating is never good if you're stressed out. Oh, would you look at that? It's a little banana. A chocolate covered banana treat. See? Put it back 
the wrapper. Oh. Hmm. I just shoved that banana right in my mouth. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm. I can taste real banana. That is so interesting. You want a bite? Okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, my goodness. That is the strangest thing, isn't it? It's like a cream filling, but it's definitely real banana in there. Mm-hmm. It's like a cake or something. Mm. Let's read about it. Banenko. It's a banana shaped chocolate covered candy bar with a banana flavored foam center. It is foamy. Distinctive in its banana shape and flavor, Banenko is a staple candy bar in the Serbia and Croatia. Well, that that's that's pretty cool, and it's a reasonable little snack. It's not very big. I don't, I don't eat the whole thing. Oh my goodness. Hmm. I know. I'm. Hmm. I'm not gonna pick on myself today. I. You know. Sometimes you just gotta let it go. Mmm. That was good. If you're stressed and freaking out, sometimes the best thing is to let yourself go. I'm gonna save this coconut bar. It's a kitty coconut dessert by Poinya. Kitty coconut desserts are chocolate bars with a chewy coconut flavored filling. Chewy in texture and sweet with a distinctive coconut taste. If you like the taste of coconuts, you'll love these chocolates. I'm going to save this because I think my wife and daughter would like it better. I hope nobody minds, but I'm going to skip that. We're going to get into this big box here. Euro creme biscuits. Now, if you're into tea, you might like biscuits. Have a biscuit. We call them cookies in the United States. And these cookies are, well, it's a chocolate flavored or chocolate covered biscuit with hazelnut cream filling. The cream filling is not too sweet and its flavor Nicely balanced with the outer layer of chocolate it is recommended to enjoy with a cup of tea. But I'm going to rinse my mouth out with Coca Cola because I'm hardcore like that. <clears throat> I'm definitely a sugar freak. Okay, so that's pretty cool. like a massive okay 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 this is like a vanilla wafer and it's like a black and white uh, black and white cookie with a hazelnut filling in the middle I can kind of tell because this one's chocolate covered and that one is not Mmm. Mmm. Oh my. That is so tasty, fluffy. Mmm. It's not squishy like the filling of an Oreo. Oh, it is, just a little. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mmm. That was really tasty. Mm. 
so you can have one. Don't eat all the marshmallow. Save me a couple. Okay, now this is just a little thing. It's a tortica. Delicious, crunchy, chocolate-covered wafers with hazelnut filling. Package is in individual sealed wrappers. They are fresh and crunchy to the taste due to their small size and perfect snack for on the go. So that is perfect for like in your pocket. So like if you're in a hurry, in the field, this might be a good snack. You know, it, it might hold up well. Okay, okay so it's just a little cracker. When I was a kid, my parents used to buy these chocolate vanilla wafer cookies like this. Now, personally, I can't stand these, but this one is very good. It's just the right mix of uh, wafer filling. Hmm. Really good. Like I said, I don't normally like these, but this was very good. Okay. Now, I am going to skip this right here. I'm going to save these for my wife and my daughter because I don't like mocha. I can't drink coffee. That's why I drink Coca-Cola. <clears throat> so we're going to save these. And it's such a wonderful little box. I mean, it's nice quality. But we're going to read about it. Napolitanka. Napolitanka by Crass is the most famous wafer product in Serbia, Croatia. And mocha is the most popular flavor. Perfect for coffee lovers and is has the added health benefit of being low in sodium and low in fat. So that's a good healthy snack. We could use these around the office. We got coffee drinkers. They're perfect for that, I think. Don't you? I, I agree. You want to try these? Okay, well you can have some. Of course, I just, I'm going to save mine for them. But you're welcome to have a couple if you want. Okay, now these look interesting. Five plus one for free. I think that's what gratis means. And it is a animal kingdom. <clears throat> animal kingdom is a thin piece of chocolate designed and packaged with a sticker of a cute mascot. With its thin texture, small size, and cute packaging, Animal Kingdom is a favorite for children in Serbia and Croatia. This is baseball cards. This is the Croatian I am really into this because culturally I know what I'm looking at. of football or baseball cards. It's a pack of cards that they use to sell gum. That's what baseball cards are. They were meant to sell gum. Well, nobody chews the gum. It's nasty. But they would put the baseball cards in to sell the gum. Well, this is the same thing. It's very cool. Okay, look how it's packaged. 
Okay, so you have a little chocolate card here. And it's just a little chocolate. Okay. Hmm. And underneath the card. Oh wow. Is what is that? It's a little card of a seal. So the children collect the cards to get all the little animals, see how they're numbered? Just like a baseball card. And they eat the chocolate, or as we do in the United States, they chew the gum. Mm, it's tasty. It's, it's okay. It's not bad. So that's pretty cool. Culturally, I think that's really neat. And they gave me a whole bunch of them. Isn't that cool? That is so neat. Mmm. That's interesting. Okay. So, what do we have left? Alright. Okay, here's the pretzels. Now, unfortunately they didn't travel well. Risky. <clears throat> We have mocha, chocolate, um, some fruit flavors, banana, and almost everything's related to chocolate, so that's very interesting. Okay, these are Hello Grinsky Peanut Pretzel Sticks. They are lightly salted pretzel sticks with a peanut flavored filling. They are savory and crunchy at the same time. Mm-hmm. It is recommended to enjoy them with a cup of tea, which we already discussed is not going to happen. <clears throat> not, a, not much of a okay, tea or oh wow, they're 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 tiny. They're not what I expected. They have peanut butter in them. See that? Hmm. Well, that's just kind of fun. Hmm. Huh. That's neat. You like that? Mm-hmm. That's kind of fun. I like that. Can you save those? Those are fun. And, <clears throat> well, let's see what we're down to. We're going to save the coconut bar. Now we're down to some exquisite looking chocolate bars. And we're gonna read about each one before we taste them. Um, let's see, Doring? Dorina is a flagship chocolate product from of Crass, one of the finest chocolate manufacturers in the world. Founded in 1911. Dorina Keck is a richly flavored chocolate bar with biscuit pieces embedded within the chocolate. So that's this one. One of the best chocolate bars, best chocolate companies in the world. Right here. Okay. And this is a Euro Cream. Um, Euro Cream Biscuit is a chocolate flavored biscuit with hazelnut cream filling. The cream filling is not too sweet and its flavor nicely balanced with the outer layer of chocolate it is recommended to be enjoyed with a cup of tea. This is going to be pretty intense. It's not every day. <clears throat> I'm going to save the Dorina till last. It's not every day you have the best chocolate in the world. We're going to have this first. We're going to take a look at it. That's quite a candy bar. It's very smooth. Very interesting. Very different. Mm. It's basically a 
a chocolate bar. Hmm. What do they got? That's interesting. Not a huge hazelnut fan, but it's good. It's definitely good. Put that down here. Now we're going to have this. The best. Look, it's uh, packaged to be sold in the United States. That's interesting. This company doesn't mess around. <clears throat> they don't mess around at all. I need a knife to get in here. <clears throat> Can't open it up. Hmm. Oh, right here. I'm supposed to split it. Oh, that's cool. I don't mess around. Okay. So you split the wrapper. Okay. And it's the back of it. You open it. And that is the front of the candy bar. Look at that. Well, I am privileged today. I'll give you a piece, don't worry. Okay. There's a chocolate piece. Hmm. That's interesting. There's one for you. There you go. And I'll just take this other one. Um. Hmm. It's very good. It's very good. It's a very good milk chocolate candy bar. Both are very good. I'm not sure which one I like better. But I think this one's kind of interesting for its own merit. And they're both very tasty. Very tasty. <clears throat> okay. So, I ate everything in the <clears throat> box included and I'm going to pick a personal favorite. Let's see. If I had my personal favorite, well the banana I get a couple pretzels to get the chocolate out of my mouth. Mmm. Very good. Um, and they're lightly salted too. They, they aren't very salty, which is good. Of course, I skipped this and the mocha crackers, but we did have other biscuits. I'm going to save this for the family because they love coconut. So, um, these were very good. These were excellent. I absolutely love these. So the Kiki Plus fruit flavored toffee candies were probably the, the best thing that I liked. I like the peanut pretzels. I like the Animal Kingdom cards. Those were interesting. All the chocolates were very good. <clears throat> these were very good. Very good. But I think my all-time favorite, and I'm going to steal one more, I haven't stuffed enough sugar down my gullet, were the 
Munchmallow cookies. They're not called cookies either. They're called... I think they would call them biscuits. They're not biscuits either. See, in America, this is a cookie. A cookie's a cookie. This is a cookie to us. And I love how they're foily wrapped. I just love that. And I love how they're... They're very, they're very nice. Like I said, they didn't travel well, but that's okay. Mmm. Look at that. Mmm. That is so yummy. For my tummy. Mm-hmm. You like them too? Mm-hmm. And it's a good chocolate fudge flavor covering. And foil crunches right up. Throw it away. Mm. Mm. That and the banana. I can't find it now. <clears throat> the panenko and the marshmallow cookies are probably my all-time favorite. Followed by Kiki Plus Fruit Snacks, which I found quite enjoyable. So, you do feel better? Well, sometimes just sitting down, talking about your problems with someone, Sharing food. Sharing an experience. This was fun. It was educational. It was um, interesting. And it was um, so, uh, from a different place, different part of the world that you know, we here in the Midwest of the United States aren't used to. So it was a lot of fun. And sometimes when you have anxiety or stress, just getting your mind off things. Taking yourself to a far off place in your mind. Experiencing new and exciting treats can help you relax. It can help the stress of the day go away. I certainly feel better having done this with you. And I'm glad you joined me today. If you're interested in these treats, please Contacts, you can contact um, Mystery Giant Mystery Box of Treats if you're interested in exploring more and see what other countries they have to offer. If you think about it, okay, you get a box of treats. It takes you all month to eat them. And you get to see so many different parts of the world and experience what they like. It's a real opportunity to expand your knowledge, keep your mind off your problems for five minutes, and just have fun. And it's harmless. A couple little snacks here and there. Never hurt anyone. Okay. Well, thank you once again for joining me with my treats box. Hopefully we'll see all of you again soon. And until I do, this is your friend, Dr. Andrew Michaels, wishing you a most blessed day. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.